Figma versus Sketch, which one should you pick? Since I started working in this industry, I think this particular question was one of the most asked questions amongst designers that are just starting out. And even if the internet is full of videos like this, people still want to know what tools they should pick in 2021. And it's a fair question. So let's get started. First things first, pricing. The pricing plan is slightly different for both Figma and Sketch and they offer different benefits for your money. Sketch starts at $9 a month per editor, which is the equivalent of $108 a year. But they also offer an yearly plan, which is $99, which basically will save you $9 a year or the equivalent of one month. But at this price, you only get the actual editor. If you want to create prototypes, although Sketch allows you to create and animate prototypes inside the app, if you want to share these prototypes with your clients, you'll need to use other apps like Marvel App, Proto.io, Framer, or Envision App. If you want to brainstorm with your team or clients, or you just need to create some mood boards, then you'll need tools like Miro. Or if you're working closely with the developers and need to export your design assets, you'll need tools like Zeppelin to make your life a bit easier. And thus, if we add all these apps to your monthly cost, we will get to around 30 plus dollars a month for the entire cost. Now with Figma, on the other hand, you have all these other tools included in the actual package, meaning that Figma offers you the possibility to create and share prototypes, give access to developers to the design assets and a bunch of other cool features that, to be honest, made my life a lot easier since I started using it in terms of price. Figma starts at $15 a month or $12 a month if you buy the annual subscription. And for that, they also provide the new Figma Jam for free until 2022, which is a collaboration tool similar to Miro or Mural, which if you compare it to Sketch will be around the same price. If you take in consideration all the extra tools you'll need to get Sketch in order to have access to the same functionalities as Figma. Now, the advantage that Figma has is that they have a free plan that you can start using to design and learn and create some UI designs. Unlike Sketch, that gives you access to their editor tool, but for only 30 days. In my opinion, giving Figma a slight advantage over Sketch for those people who just want to start out in UX UI design or for those people who just want to play around with the tool. Number two features and functionalities. In terms of feature, there are no huge differences between the two. Both will provide the same features and functionalities when it comes to creating vector based interfaces. Now, when it comes to prototyping and animating your designs, again, Figma has a slight advantage over Sketch as they provide a way for you to share your prototype with just a simple click. While Sketch, although provides all the necessary tools for you to be able to prototype and animate your designs, there is no easy way you can share the prototype with your colleagues or clients. You can share documents in Sketch, but sometimes you just want to create a quick link that you can share with your clients and get some feedback or just use it for a user testing session. And because of that, Figma gets another point for this one. Number three, ease of use. Again, both tools provide an excellent user experience while using these apps. Both Figma and Sketch have worked extensively to perfect their user interface in order to make our lives a lot easier and help us with the design process. So for this one, I would say that it's a tie. Now, depending on your background and what tools you previously use in your career, you may prefer one over the other. But from my point of view, I would say that no matter what tool you choose, you will not be disappointed when it comes to its interface, as they both provide a great user experience. Number four, let's talk about plugins. I know a lot of people are worried about this, but this one is so easy. The most popular plugins out there that everyone uses are on both platforms, meaning that neither tool will provide you with that edge when it comes to the plugins. So if you're worried about plugins, don't be. Figma and Sketch will provide you with all the plugins you need. Trust me. Number five, compatibility. Regarding compatibility, Sketch is only compatible with Mac OS operating systems. There is a Windows app though, which gives you the possibility to interpret Sketch files. 
However, you need a Mac in order to work or edit the design files. On the other hand, it is possible to work with Figma on all operating systems like Mac OS, Windows and Linux. The only thing that they need to have is to have a web browser. Despite having greater availability than Sketch, Figma might be a problematic solution for designers that also need to work offline. Even though it's possible to work with Figma without an internet connection, not all functionalities are available. Plus, designers have to be careful and remember to keep saving the files since it will not do it automatically, as it happens when the user is online. Number 6. Users. Here things start to be a bit different. Although Figma is relatively new to the industry as it was released on the 27th September 2016 I believe compared to Sketch who was initially released on 7th September 2010. Its popularity grew exponentially over the years and although Sketch is dominating the market at the current moment, I think that it won't take long until Figma will flip the stats. And for the last point, the bottom line. The bottom line is that whatever tool you pick, you will not be disappointed, as they are both amazing tools and provide you with all the necessary functionalities, features and plugins for you to be able to create stunning UI designs. Personally, I use both of them and I switch between them depending on the project, but because I don't want to end this video just like all the other videos out there, I will answer some of the most popular questions I've been asked in the past with my personal opinion, okay? So if you're just starting out, which tool should I pick? Figma. Which tool is best for collaborating with a large team? Figma. What tools do you use with most of your clients? Figma. So currently I'm using Sketch. What other tools should I start learning? Figma. One hour later. Figma. 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 